Hello, welcome to Fort Green Hall. I'm in the parlour. I've shown some photos on Facebook of the uh, the floorboards up, but I thought I'd do a little film. So we've got the joists holding the uh, very thick oak floorboards. Straight joists. And then we get to the corners and we've got a diagonal joist there and a matching one over at the far end those are called dragon beams and they uh, sort of project over the, uh, the downstairs and it forms the jetty the bit that sticks out and these are some very interesting stones It's been suggested that they're part of the remains of a wall, but they're in the timber part of the house and there was never a wall here. What are they for? So here is the position of the floor below and then it juts out as the jetty. So these are kind of above the jetty. Any ideas? Where's the stone from? There's a tradition that all the stone at Ford Green Hall, particularly um, the foundations, what there is of them, the house just sits on a row of stones, possibly are from Halton Abbey. Are these? We don't know. So, the scaffolding to repair this beam here. You can see how much it's rotted there. All that piece is gone. All this has got to come out. This is the sole plate. The scaffolding has got to come and hold some of these joists and then more going up through the ceiling or somewhere over here to this beam to hold the weight of the house and it's got to be jacked up so that they can take this beam out and put a nice new one in easy. I think not. I'll take you through to the hall chamber. And again we've got some more floorboards up. Nothing exciting underneath I'm afraid. No coins, no treasure. It's quite dark over this corner. There's the jetty again. You can see some daylight over there. So there we go. That's where we're at. There's some scaffolding boards coming over the uh, over the hedge there. Putting the outside scaffolding up today and then Monday they're breaking through the walls to come in. So that's where we are at the moment. Hope you found that interesting. If anybody's got any theories over these stones, please let us know. Very interesting to find out. Thanks very much. Take care.